In this video, we're just going to have a look at how we can manage the content in the content blocks from an options page uh, using advanced custom fields and just how you can then use these blocks on your website in different places then to represent the content. So here we have a page that I've created called blocks and on here we just have some random blocks and then here on the home page we have the actual content. So the blocks were made from the content on this page. So if I was going to, um, let's say I have these blocks placed strategically on the website and I want to change the content of the block, I can head over here to my options page. So this time I'm just going to say hoodies only. So we're just going to do the hoodies and then where we had the uh, really cheaper than chips. We're now going to say something along the lines of um, really cheaper than chips clothing. So now we're focusing on clothing here and we're focusing on hoodies there and update. Now you'll see that uh, on the home page. We'll refresh that. And now you'll see that we just have the hoodie products. Just excuse that image, but it's part of the hoodie range. And down here we have really cheaper than chips, but it's only clothing. What that also means now is wherever I have placed that block in the website, we should have the same content. So there we have it. So we now have that same content everywhere on the website. So the nice thing now is that you can strategically place these blocks and this would then essentially work in the same way that um, we would uh, do it in Oxygen. So in Oxygen, what you're able to do is you're able to come over here and make a piece reusable. So instead of making reusable content, you can use the blocks in Gutenberg then to do the same thing. So you can then place your promotional material in strategic places and when you want to change the focus of the website in this case we've linked it to an options page and you can manage everything centrally so i hope you found that useful thank you for watching